Welcome to tutorial number four. Uh, we're going to be talking about numbering prefixes, things like kilo, mega and so forth. But fortunately for you, uh, for your foundation assessment, you only need to know three of them and I'll tell you what those three are. Fortunately, the numbering prefixes that you need to learn for your foundation assessment are pretty much used in everyday language. For example, milli, you would have heard of the term milliliters. A milliliter is one thousandth of a meter, of a liter, sorry. Uh, I spelt that wrong. Uh, a milli is one thousandth. And the symbol for milli is a little m. So, for example, 50 millivolts is equal to 50 thousandth of a volt. So, milli means one thousandth. Next one is kilo. Now, you would be familiar with kilometer. A kilometre is a thousand metres, kilometre. So, kilo means one thousand times. Opposite to a milli. A milli is a thousandth, which is very small, and a kilo is a thousand times. Just another example. Uh, five kilo litres would equal five thousand litres. And the last one is mega. Mega, you might have heard of a megalitre of water. The, a megalitre of water is a million litres of water. Uh, so mega means a million times. The symbol for mega is a capital M. So five megalitres of water would be five million litres of water. They're the ones you need to know for your foundation assessment. There are a lot of others and I'm going to show you them just quickly. You don't have to learn them. You will notice that in your foundation manual the publication, your entry into amateur radio, milli, kilo and mega are bolded and they're done, they've done that so that you know they're the ones that you have to commit to memory. Here is a more complete table. You don't need to worry about this column on the left hand side. That's how to put these numbers into a calculator and you won't need to do that until you do your standard or your advanced theory. So here are the names of all the prefixes of the, that we're ever ever likely to use and you can see there's a lot of them. Yotta, Zeta, Exa, Peta, Terra and so on. <coughs> Giga you're probably familiar with, uh, with computers. You've got giga, gigabytes of uh, memory or, or, or on a memory stick you've got a four gigabyte memory stick. The important ones for you, for the foundation, are milli, oh, I can't highlight that, milli which is one thousandth and the symbol is M, uh, looking for kilo, kilo, symbol is a little k and that means a thousand times and mega, capital M and that means a million times. <clears throat> Excuse me, that's all you need to remember for your uh, foundation assessment. You'll find this slide in the document folder of your DVD if you're watching this course on a DVD through the Radio and Electronics School. Well that's it for this tutorial, short tutorial just on numbering systems, mega, milli and kilo, remember them. Cheers for now, this is Ron VK2DQ, catch you in the next tutorial.